All right, guys, I hope you're doing well. I came out to Tenerife for a few days because I was sick of the English weather, but I wanted to get to you a trading idea on the Pound Aussie because there's a really nice structure-based setup that I want to share with you. So uh, let's get stuck straight into it. So this is the Pound Aussie, okay? And the reason I've gone out to the weekly is because this is one of the pairs that you, you really want the highest probability setups because you want the, the tightest, shallowest window for entry and you want the biggest reward to risk. And if you can just keep doing that on this pair, you're gonna do all right. So I've gone out to the weekly and you can see previous support became resistance and we did not, we had this big bullish candle, which we know doesn't go on forever. And we didn't close above the highs, okay? Didn't close above the highs. Now, when we drop down to the daily, we can also see um, that we respected those highs. So we did not close above this high here, which was um, 182.75. Okay, we haven't closed above 182.75. So what that means is we're respecting this high following a big bullish run. And those of you who like to trade... Um, you know, equal measured moves and things like that. I know a couple of you guys were looking at some equal measured moves in here last week um, and doing some CTS style training. Some of you had a cipher pattern, some of you had another pattern, but ultimately structure based. This is a really nice bullish run. Hit this like a wall. Don't we didn't violate previous structure, so all we need is some kind of entry technique. <clears throat> now on the four hour, we've got this beautiful double top okay so if you got in on this you would have entered you would have actually entered on this candle here which was five o'clock yesterday if you're not in on this you're pretty much getting the same um you know the same price uh you'd be selling this at market if this is something you're allowed to enter and then your atr base stop would be above you know an atr above this high now bear in mind this is the four hour time frame, so it's still it's still gonna be quite chunky. But anyway, <clears throat> we're entering at 82.55, and you're gonna be up at about 83, 83.50 something, okay? So it's, although it looks like a tight uh, entry, you're pretty much getting a um, 100 pip stop. Right, um, stop loss. Even if you got, you know, a couple of a few pips above that fifty level, so eighty three, fifty three, uh, fifty two. Let's just go. Um, that's still a big old stop loss. Having said that, because it's such a high probability setup, <clears throat> um, your reward to risk is going to be pretty decent because it will be down here. So, you know, you don't want to fight through any of this. Um, 8042s for take profit, 8042 for take profit, and you can see that that's a, definitely a two to one, two and a bit to one, two and a half to one, something like that. If I could use these tools, I could show you. Here we go. So this position, although it's 100 pips nearly of, of risk, it's a 2.1 to one. Right, so that's what I'm looking at. Let me know what you're looking at in the comments and uh, I'll catch you guys in the next video.